Having my period is the worst. I be so miserable, y'all. Oh my God. Like, my body is in pain. I'm overly emotional. I'm cranky. I'm sleepy. My fucking titties hurt. But most of all, I am hungry, okay? I am hungry. And I'm craving everything that goes against my diet. And I'm not about to make myself suffer more than I already am. Fuck that. This is what I eat in a day while sticking to my diet, while you're satisfying my cravings. I'm trying this new thing where I break my fast with fruits and raw veggies only. My favorite fruit combo is watermelon, lemon, and then a little bit of honey. It's so sweet and it tastes like candy. Watermelon helps you stay hydrated. It's packed with nutrients and reduces inflammation. Watermelon is an antioxidant, digestive, and health aid. Good for skin health and an anti-inflammatory. And honey is a natural antioxidant, anti-inflammatory, and antibacterial. It's sweet and it satisfies my candy cravings. Now I'm craving something with some salt. So I'm going to make a little DIY tortilla pizza. I'm just going to lay out a low-carb tortilla. And then I'm just going to spread some coconut oil on it so it could get a nice crunch to it. I'm going to add some tomato paste, spread that all the way around. And then I'm going to add some onion powder, some garlic powder, and some basil. And after I do that, I'm just going to add some mozzarella cheese. After that, I'm just adding some plant-based sausages because I need that, I need that feeling of meat. After that, I'm just going to put it in the oven on 400 degrees and I'm going to leave it for 15 minutes and after that, I'm going to eat, period. For dinner, I'm making some chicken breasts and carrots. I like them both because you can season them to your liking and still stay in a good calorie intake range. I season my chicken with some all-purpose onion powder, garlic powder, cayenne pepper, paprika, and basil. I bake it in a pan of chicken broth so that the chicken doesn't get dry. I cook it for an hour on 375 and then I let it crisp for 20 minutes. I'm eating my meal with this poppy soda. It's an apple cider vinegar probiotic that tastes so good, like actual soda. It has five grams of sugar and less than 25 calories in each can. I started craving chocolate, so I was making some chocolate chip oatmeal cookies without all the unhealthy shit. I'm gonna smash three bananas Add some cinnamon, some allspice, and then after that, I'm going to add some chia seeds and vanilla extract, some honey, and then I'm going to add some oatmeal. I usually add peanut butter too, but I forgot. I'm going to mix everything up, shape my cookies, and then add some chocolate chips. Then I'm gonna put it in the oven on 400 degrees for 15 minutes and then they'll be ready to serve. I love this as my dessert because it's packed with fiber, protein, and ingredients that naturally de-stress you. I get to satisfy my chocolate cravings without going overboard while still getting my fiber and protein in. Try these PMS recipes at home and let me know if you like them. If you did, consider subscribing. My name is TLC and don't forget to give yourself TLC.